hello everyone this is Crystal Fadoff and today I'm going to demonstrate a wax removal method uh, called the oven method so I'm holding the camera in my hand so I'll pardon the shakiness to start off with the oven is set to 200 degrees Fahrenheit I have uh, these two eggs you don't have to do two you can do one at a time these are two chicken eggs they're sitting in this pie plate I'm going to put them in the oven, right like that, okay, and I will let them sit in there for a few minutes. Uh, so to talk about uh, different wax removal methods, you've seen uh, me use the heat gun to remove the wax, and you can also use the candle method where you hold the egg next to a candle. Uh, and you hold it next to it, not in it and never over the top of it. Uh, that is another way to remove the wax, a very traditional method. You can use a chemical method using something like Gugan or mineral spirits to remove the wax. I don't do that too often because it's very smelly and it's very messy. About the only time I do that is uh, if I'm trying to get wax out of a crevice of something that I've etched um, and also if I ever use alcohol ink on an egg rather than the aniline dyes you really need to use the uh, the mineral spirits because the other methods and I've tried them they tend to cause the alcohol ink to smear when you go to take the wax off so you think you're going to have a white line and you end up with like a, a, a blue like a slightly blue line if your egg you'd use the blue on it so uh, this is the oven method I use this method if I have a whole bunch of like if I have a dozen eggs I've been working on I use this method because it's relatively quick um, to do so the eggs have been in there for about a uh, little over a minute and you can see they're a little shiny normally I do this two-handed but I'm gonna grab my tissue and you can see the wax came off okay now I'm gonna put this back in there it didn't all come off put those back in there and let them sit for a couple minutes you just want to be careful when you take them out they are hot uh, so be careful and use a, I used a oven mitt to pull out the you know if the tr the rack <laughs> it's hot be careful uh, let them cool before you do anything else to them just like you would if you use the heat gun or the candle method Again, I've had some good success with it. Make sure you have unplugged your egg before you put it in there. If you, you have a wax plug in it, make sure you've removed that. Hope you find that helpful. Thanks for watching.